He's the one everyone's talking about, Ashlyn Herbert. He is Flashlyn Herbert, the man who's the fastest. Everything he does, he goes hard, he goes quick. His fellow ninja mates, Zach and Dirt, watch on. And Zach already booked his place in stage two earlier. Charlie Robbins' time to beat is 1.02, left on the clock. And you'll have to really keep your eye on Ashlyn Herbert here. He does not blink, he does not wait. Oh, have a look at that. At that. Absolutely perfect. Don't blink, don't move your eyeballs from your TV screen. This guy could go all the way up Mount Midoriyama. Ashton Herbert already nearly finished on the swinging cliffhanger. Oh, he has finished it, now he's onto the wing nuts. He had trouble on this obstacle in last year's grand final, but he looks confident tonight. Just moving on to the second nut. And he won't waste too much time before transitioning to the next. There he goes, oh, straight away Ashton. and off. And now he's got the warped wall in his sights and he's up without breaking a stride. Only 45 seconds gone. This is astonishing, Ben. He's six seconds inside the fastest time of the night, except by Charlie Robbins. This guy is making this course look like a child's playground. Here he goes now. He's onto the hinge, the first panel. Almost there. Swings around. Look at him, so cool and calm. Now, when Charlie Robbins completed this course there was one minute and two seconds left on the clock ashlyn's got two minutes left but he needs to concentrate on the spider jump oh ashlyn. ashlyn wasn't a perfect landing but he is powering his way through the corridor now get this one minute 50 left on the clock he's laying the law down he's saying to all these ninjas catch me if you can and at this stage, no one's catching him. Come on, Ash, look at this. It seemed unbelievable that anyone could beat Charlie Robbins' time, but he's doing just that, Ashlyn Herbert. This is phenomenal. Wow. And now he's pressing the buzzer. Oh, my word. Does it with his head. One minute 32 left on the clock. Take a bow, Ashlyn Herbert. He doesn't hesitate. He doesn't overthink what he's going to do. He just does it. And he finishes stage one. 30 seconds faster than Charlie Robbins. How do you compete with that?